to Euler's theorem on when we can or cannot draw a graph with a single line, we have a special case where the number of vertices whose degree is odd, so how many vertices have a, a degree, an odd degree, when, when, when it's two, is two, when there's two of them, then we have a path, an Eulerian path. Now what is a path? Well, unlike a circuit, a path cannot return to the original vertices. So in this shape right here, notice there are two vertices with an odd degree. So these one, two, they have one, two, three edges going to each of them. And every other vertice has an even degree. So when there are exactly two vertices whose degree is odd, we have a path. And this means um, I can start at any vertice and draw the shape with a single line, but I will not be able to return to my starting point. It's impossible. So let's just look at that. If I draw the edges here, going around my shape, And there are many ways to do this. And here, notice I'm running to a difficulty for sure. And actually, I'm sorry, uh, to, to complete this, and we'll talk about it in another video, notice I couldn't start here. There's no way to do it because there, this vertice had uh, a degree of 2. So to actually, to actually be able to do this, I have to start at one of the odd vertices. And we'll talk about why in uh, upcoming videos. But let's just start here. So I can go this way. up here, going around, and now you can see that I can do it. I can actually draw the shape of the single line. But notice, I was unable to return to my original starting point. And that's what a path is. A path is just, think about walking around the shape. You're not going to return, it's not a loop or a circuit, but you will be able to actually finish the entire shape with a single line. And this happens when the number of vertices whose degree is odd is exactly two, and that's what an Eulerian path is. If you want to think about a circuit, a circuit would be uh, almost the same shape, right? Just look at this arrow shape. Now I'm not going to draw the dots in, but let's assume the vertices are in the same location. Now in this instance, the degree of every vertice is, is, is even, so we can actually walk around this shape and start at any point and still return back to the original spot. And that's what a circuit is. A circuit returns to the original spot. So that's just an introduction to the path. And we'll talk about in other videos um, why does this make sense and how can we prove it. So I hope you enjoyed that.